Hello and welcome to the Blubber Play, what will be our The Cloth Hawthby, Hawthy and the Habsburg Prince series. So, I had a go at this before, and eventually I ate basically, I ate this, I ate this, I ate this, I ate this, and I was friends with the Soviets. And then Germany demanded my Sudetenland, and the Soviets, instead of coming and pushing units this way, you know, through Romania, which was me. Like I said, I owned all of this. No, instead he went and positioned a million units on the Japan border, because Japan was one of their allies that hadn't been called into the war yet. And they're like, oh, well maybe they're going to get called into the war in a second. No. Put your units where there's actually currently fights, instead of where there might one day in the future potentially be fights. Or at least put some here and some here, but not all of your units here and none of them where there are real fights. Anyway, bitching over. We do this, we do two, three, everything else. Usual candidates here. And I've worked out a new solution to fix this problem. Is that instead of going immediately communist, we'll go fascist, eat everything, then turn communist. He can't eat me if I'm fascist in his faction when the Sudetenland comes, and then after that I just swap over to being on the commies side. So that is the current plan. Zoom out, watch Ethiopia get slowly dismantled. Ooh, more steel you say. So be it. Now, the nice thing about going fascist first is that we're actually much closer to fascism than we are um, communism. So we should be able to do that quicker and maybe fit in some more war. Or at least have an easier time fitting them in. Zoltan. Thank you. Time to go get our fascist. Yeah.
Prince. Come on, Italy, you can beat Ethiopia. Why you take so long? Well done, Jesse Owens. Dearest. We then do demand a referendum. And now our political power gain is just absurd. For a non Germany. Germany's is super absurd. Political power go. So what we should do is we should move our airplanes up. Tell them to come out. Be ready for this. Wait until we can start moves without as much penalty. take a month off so we go to the industrial revitalization oh my god I have never seen that happen before I've tried this like 20 times well, that might be a bit of an exaggeration but I've tried it a lot So cool. Blue. The only downside is it means we didn't get to get rid of our disarmed nation. This becomes demand Czechoslovakia.
Also, did we inherit better units? Yes, we inherited a much better unit template. Well, you know what? All our old crappy units can go die in a fire. Especially... Fascism ho! Just reform thingy. We'll see. But you know what? <clears throat> it's time to end the episode. So I hope you've enjoyed watching and that you'll join us again soon. Bye bye.